A group under the auspices of the Association of Beauty Pageants and Fashion Exhibition Organization of Nigeria says it's right time for Nigerians to make it right by again choosing a leader who has the interests of the masses at heart. The group made this known in Abuja at the World Press Conference and inauguration of standing committees, zonal directors, and state chairmen, which was recently voted into power to oversee the affairs of the association. The group said they are ready to mobilize millions of youths to vote in the right candidate come 2023 as the country prepares for its general election. Our members, uh, which have grown to up to 11.3 million people across the 36 states of the Federation, including and 37 states, including FCC, have been reluctant and docile towards participating in elections. The reason is because the governments that have come, you know, since from 1999 have really not been so embracing towards pageantry in Nigeria. And so for us, we have decided the new wave or the new chapter, which is started by our, the humble servant, King Fajak, uh, the president of the association, have decided that this is a time for us to chant the cause, to change the narrative. And so what we want to do now is to be able to get our members. 11.3 million is not a joke. And so we have decided to mobilize our members across boards. Because obviously, people get to wonder, why is it that over 50 million persons pick a PVC? And then you see a 22 million coming to vote eventually. I believe that the lacuna that we are facing, those other millions that refuse to come to the polling booth, are members of our association who are aggrieved with the fact that this government or the previous government have not been carrying us along. And so this time around, the president have decided that to, in order to change the narrative, he will appeal to our members across all the states that they shouldn't just only pick their PVCs, but they should get ready to vote a person or drum support for the person who is more entertainment inclined towards embracing association of beauty parties. They say the association has come to stay and will regulate all activities of beauty pageants in Nigeria. Afion is a registered association saddled with the responsibility to uphold the rights of pageant organizers, models, contestants, and also checkmate the activities of the pageant and fashion brands towards promoting the image of Nigeria for national honors and international recognition. Our goals and objectives are, one, to checkmate and streamline the activities of beauty pageants in Nigeria, to correct negative activities in the pageant industry, three, to foster unity and progress amongst pageant organizers, four, to protect and defend the rights of models, contestants, beauty queens, and pageant organizers. My administration, which is team, the new chapter, is centered on making the goals and objectives of a reality. I wish to use this medium to call on my colleagues in all the 36 states of the Federation, including the FCT, to join hands with me and the new executives to actualize this dream. In the coming weeks, the association will, like he rightly said, will come up with a lot of um, um, projects that will further um, take us to where we are headed. One of these is to verify and um, license all pageants in Nigeria, as well as um, fashion exhibition shows. As we do that, we'll also be licensing models, beauty queens, and participants of each of these events that come up. This way, we have a well-structured and um, registered members who we get to monitor and regulate their activities. One of the highlights at the event is the presentation of certificates of return to the elected members. In Abuja, LM Chukwemeka reports.